before we start this video, I'd like to say thank you for all watching and peace out and stay salty. What's up, guys? It's me, Salty Pro, back with another video. Um, we are gonna doing a breakfast video. So as you guys saw, I have an intro, but yes, I have an intro, but I still don't have the music. So that will be coming up in another video, maybe. I, I'm still trying to, like, you know, la la la, you know. So let's get right into this video and let's start cooking. All right, guys, we're back. Oh shoot, let's start right here. So, um, yes, I just changed the angle. Let me get the stuff and yeah, let's do this. So a lot of you guys may not like this, but I love it. It's the best. It's just really good. So, so what you guys need is some turkey or chicken. I have this chicken. I just opened it, but it doesn't have a lot, so I'll just get some turkey from here. It's still good. All right, so be, first you have to cut this up, right? Wait, we need a little pan real quick. Hold right here. That's kind of huge. Let me see if I have a little more room. Let me see that. Here we go, we got a little one. You don't, you don't really need a big, big uh, pan. Oops, just put that in. Because, um, you really, it's just for me, so, yeah. So what you want to do is cut this first. Be careful for the supervision. I have, um, like, I always put this. My mom approves. So what you want to do is cut them into strips like this. So they have like, ooh, ooh. they have like layers, you know? You guys can see the layers right there. So at first you want to cut them into strips like this, and then kind of have them still lined up. You don't want to put them in yet. And then what you want to do is kind of cut them. So first you're like this, right? They're in strips. And then now you just want to cut them like this. So that's what I'll be doing. So you can like, not have them all in a big and yes they might uh like like be a little bit too big but then you can always just cut see as i just cut it so now you just want to cut them and it's fine if they get out of place I'm just try to cut them and then see like this one see how all they are like right here like see how i was already cutting it I gotta do strip it, that's fine. So see, now I got all these little pieces. Now what you wanna do is nice clean oil in here. Nice clean oil. It's clean oil, we literally just put it in here. Now you don't wanna put a lot, so like, like that's good. What do you want? Put it back where you have got it. As you guys can see, there's the oil. You don't want to have a lot of oil, or else it would like pop. And plus, it's not really. And this already has like some oil, I guess. So now you just wanna kind of get it all over the place. You don't want to have it too too high. So low, on low heat, right there, like that. Low heat, on low heat. Just can see you can spray it. See it. Um, let me get to you guys back when that's already heated up. Alright guys, it hasn't heated up yet, but I, for, I just forgot. We need this in too. So, uh, so if you want more, then just get more of what you got. Oh shoot, that just freaking scared me. But that wasn't good anymore, so I'm just gonna make it with this. And I don't really want a lot. That one was bad. I guess I got. It. We haven't still used it. So let me get my things from. Let's heat it up. I think it's already heated up. Okay, let's. To be to make sure, you just want to throw a little chunk in there like this. Yep, it's ready. When you start he hearing a little bit of bubbles, then look. See like that. All right, guys. Let me set you guys up a different angle. And yep. Alright guys, we're at a different angle. Then you need a spoon. A spoon. Yeah, just to mix them up. See, and then you kind of want to turn it down a little. Because you don't want to burn. 
burn them, but yeah. Quick video with salty Pringles. So if you want me to do a Pringle challenge, then comment down below. So now once you got it a little bit, you know, mixed up, kind of going down a little, you just want to let it sit for a while. You know, let it just do on mix in. Now when you see them getting a little bit cooked, like a little bit cooked, then I'm just gonna leave them in there for a little. And then this is this is a good time to get your eggs. So you grab your eggs. Eggs right here. Twelve large white eggs. Great eggs. Now you, of course, you all gotta open the eggs. Side. Now you still want to keep on mixing. Now this is a little, so then you just want to add one egg. One egg, and then if you want more, then you can just add more, but I don't really have that much. So now it's the time to put in the eggs. So grab your egg, you flat surface. Crack, open the egg, crack the egg. And then now you kind of want to turn it up a little bit more. Just so it is because so it cooks more base. So then you just want to mix until the egg and everything is mixed together and the egg is cooked. Just basically like making scram scrambled eggs but with ham inside. And uh, it's really good guys. Yep, it's really good. See that's how it looks right now. And it's not that much. My sister wanted something but too bad. Because we don't have no more ham or chicken. Now, still want to keep on mixing, and then just let it sit. And I'll get you. I'll get back to you guys when it's done, or when we're halfway through the cooking process. All right, guys. Now you just want to let it sit. It's been like two minutes. Just let it sit for a little bit while while you just clean up the little mess. Just putting the eggs away, you know. Just mix a little bit more. And that's what it looks like. So I hope you guys like this video. Peace out, subscribe, and like. Bye!